They say the eyes are windows to the soul, and it's important that we keep our vision health a priority through all stages of life. IQ Vision Care is now offering a new state of the art procedure for people experiencing a weakened cornea. That not only helps prevent vision loss or changes, but prevents the need for corneal transplant surgery. It kind of gets its name because what it's doing is actually linking the corneal crosslinks. These are collagen fibers in the cornea. And we use this procedure for diseases of the cornea where the structure actually becomes weakened. Crosslinking is a procedure that prevents the progression of a corneal disease following refractive surgeries such as LASIK. What we do with this procedure is we use eye drops and a UV light to cause the chemical reaction known as cross-linking. And this links those structures so that the cornea becomes nice and firm again. This stops the progression or the weakening of the cornea. Unlike LASIK, the purpose of this procedure is not used for vision correction, but because surgeries like LASIK can actually lead to weakening of the cornea, cross-linking can be used to counter that. Sometimes we'll even do a combined procedure. Well, we'll do LASIK and then we'll do cross-linking as well so that we prevent that from happening with your LASIK procedure. IQ is bringing leading technology to the valley with cross-linking that allows patients to get back to life quicker while close to home. Prior to this procedure, we really didn't have anything available for progressive keratoconus or progressive corneal ectasia. Patients would go on to have disease diseases that would require cornea transplant surgeries. The beauty of this is it can be done in the office. We don't need to use the operating room. Dr. Hawkins says overall, it's important for the entire family to keep an eye on their vision health. Even an optometrist, a glasses doctor knows how to check for keratoconus. So getting in to see your doctor is important. Even at a young age, we diagnose this even in 10 year olds. So we can find it early.